10 Interesting Verbs to Improve Your English Vocabulary from EspressoEnglish.net The English language has a lot of colorful words which are great for improving your vocabulary. In this lesson, you'll learn 10 interesting verbs with examples, and you can learn a lot more inside my Vocabulary Builder course. Number 1. Scrutinize Scrutinize means to examine or inspect very carefully, looking at all the tiny details and or checking for imperfections. For example, my classmate scrutinized my essay and found several spelling mistakes. Number 2. Flourish If something is flourishing, it is growing and developing very successfully. For example, there is a flourishing artistic community in San Francisco. Number 3. Marvel If you marvel at something, it means you are amazed or surprised by it. We usually use marvel at plus a noun. For example, when we reached the top of the mountain, we marveled at the view. You can also marvel that plus a subject and verb. For example, I marveled that he got the job without any experience. Number 4. Insinuate. To insinuate means to express something in an indirect way, not stating it directly, but making a more subtle reference that suggests it without saying it specifically. For example, let's say there's a husband and wife, and the husband has a female friend at work who he talks about a lot. If the wife says something like, you two seem quite fond of each other, she may be insinuating that there's an inappropriate relationship between her husband and this other woman. Number 5. Vouch for. To vouch for someone or something means to say you trust it, usually based on your own personal good experience with that person or thing. For example, I can vouch for the reliability of Toyota cars. I've had one for 10 years and it's never broken down. We hired an electrician who my friend vouched for. Number 6. Nag someone. To nag means to remind or ask someone repeatedly, usually in an annoying way. For example, I always forget to take out the garbage, so my wife keeps nagging me about it. Number 7. Dump. The verb dump means to throw things down or let them fall without being careful. For example, my roommate just dumps her clean clothes on the bed. She never puts them away. To dump someone is a slang way to talk about when one person ends a romantic relationship without caring about the feelings of the other person. For example, Sarah's boyfriend dumped her in order to go out with a model. Number 8. Skyrocket the verb skyrocket means to increase or go up a lot very quickly. For example, sales of the product skyrocketed after a celebrity started using it. Number 9. Flee To flee means to run away, usually from danger. The past tense is fled. For example, the refugees are fleeing from the civil war in their home country. Number 10. Reminisce to reminisce means to actively think about or talk about good past experiences. For example, my grandparents like to reminisce about when they were young. If you want to learn more vocabulary, click on the link in the video or in the description for more information about my Vocabulary Builder course. It will teach you more than 500 useful words in each level so that you can express yourself more fluently in English. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you in the course.